Welcome back to Poem Mr. Channel. In this video, we will guide you on how to wire the post on Smart 10K, and we will be using the solar distribution box to help expedite the wiring process. The distribution box comes equipped with the following device: a 250 ampere DC circuit breaker for the battery circuit. 225 ampere DC circuit breakers for the PV circuits and two 40 kilo ampere DC surge protectors. Since the Pole Sun Smart 10K features two PV inputs, we have included protection device for both PV input circuits. Additionally, there are 63 ampere and 125 ampere AC circuit breakers for the AC input, and a 40 kilo ampere AC surge protector. Finally, for AC output, there are 63 ampere and 125 ampere AC circuit breakers. When wiring for simple phase, the neutral wires should be connected to 125 ampere AC circuit breaker. After mounting the inverter and distribution box, remove the wiring cover and ensure that all the circuit breakers are in the off position before wiring. Start with the battery connections, linking the positive and negative battery terminals to the corresponding circuit breakers. When connecting the wires, make sure to observe the correct polarity to avoid reverse connections. Next. Connect the circuit breakers to the inverter ports. Once the battery connections are complete, connect both PV inputs to their respective circuit breakers. Each PV input circuit is equipped with a surge protector to ensure the safety and stability of the system. The PV input ports of the distribution box are equipped with MC4 connectors, facilitating the connection of the PV array. Moving on to the AC input wiring, connect the AC input ports to the appropriate circuit breakers that come with surge protection. Both live wires should be connected to 63 ampere circuit breakers, and the neutral wires should be connected to the 125 ampere circuit breaker. Then connect the utility power to the circuit breakers. The ground wire is connected directly through the distribution box and is linked to the ground port of the inverter's AC input. Focusing on the AC output, first connect the inverter's AC output line and the neutral ports to the corresponding circuit breakers. Connect the PE to the ground rail. Then connect the circuit breaker to the low. Don't forget to ground the inverter by connecting its grounding terminal to the ground rail. Finally, ground the grounding rail. Once all the connections are made and verify for correctness, secure the waterproof ports. This wraps up the entire wiring process for the post on Smart 10K. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment below. You are also welcome to visit our website for more information about Poe Mister Products. We look forward to seeing you in the next video.